The Springfield Police Department releasing new surveillance video tonight showing a person spray painting the Black Lives Matters mural in front of City Hall. A Western Mass News reporter Leon Purvis is live for us at the scene with more. Leon. Chris, tonight police want the public to see surveillance video back from October 5th in hopes that someone out there will help them identify the suspect. Caught on camera, a person spraying paint on the Black Lives Matter mural on Court Street. It happened just before 1 in the morning on October 5th. The Springfield Police Department is now looking for new leads. The individual came, as you see in the video, and, and took his... Uh, well, assuming his spray paint with him, uh, if that was left, that's something that fingerprints could have been ran. But, uh, you know, it's it's difficult unless you're getting caught in the act. So that's why we seek the public's help. Here in the video, you see the suspect ride a bike up to Court Street, park it at City Hall, then walk out of frame down towards the B of the Black Lives Matter mural. There, they take out spray paint and start to vandalize the mural. Public information officer Ryan Walsh says finding the bike would help, but might not solve the crime. And the description of a bicycle wouldn't necessarily help because if you had a bicycle and someone rode that here um, and returned it to you, uh, just because it's your bike, you can't necessarily charge someone because it's a bike. You got to prove that someone was on it at that exact time. In the surveillance video, part of the suspect's face is shown when they're sitting on the steps of City Hall. But Walsh says the identity of the person is unclear. There's so little of the face that was shown, even if something which the city doesn't have, a facial recognition software, it's unclear if that may have helped. But um, there's just so little of the face seen between the hood and the mask. This isn't the first time the Black Lives Matter mural was vandalized. As Springfield police detectives requested felony charges of defacement for an alleged suspect who vandalized the mural on September 14th. There have also been other incidents, but police say they're under investigation. Walsh tells Western Mass News it's difficult to patrol the mural 24-7 so this doesn't happen again. It's unfortunate. It's Officers are extremely busy. Um, they're going to calls across the city. They deal with hundreds of calls a day. Um, with this, these instances may cost some money, but there's no person that's a victim. There's plenty of people that are victims in crimes across the city every single day. Walsh adds that they could have extra patrols in the area, but officers respond to calls on an as-needed as needed basis. Anyone with information is asked to contact the Springfield Police Department. Live in Springfield, Leon Purvis, Western Mass News.